nice here. It's almost messed up how nice it is. Like I knew it wouldn't have graffiti, but I think that's a Banksy. Aisha. Aisha, are you even listening to me? No, no, not at all. That is the hottest man I've ever seen. Oh my God, he's coming. Shut up, shut up. Hi, um, do either of you know Aisha? I'm her Bayside buddy. Yeah, I'm Aisha. It's <laughs> great to meet you. This is Don't Remember. I'm Jamie Spano. If you watch it, I'm in episode 204, The Big Game. At the end, I score the losing touchdown. <laughs> I didn't know you played football, Jamie. Really? Because he's literally been holding a football all day. Huh? Oh! You know, Aisha used to play back at Douglas. You did? Like on the boys' team? Uh, I mean, I didn't want to, but they cut the girls' athletic program. I challenge you to a football off after school. We'll prove who the better football player is once and for all. Isn't that what the football tryout was for? <laughs> you wish. That was a tryout. This is a try off. <laughs> Fine. See you on the 50 yard line. No. I have a better idea. We'll do it on the football field. You ready to do this? Yeah. I'm also ready to do this. <clears throat> whoa, 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 whoa. You brought a feelings helmet to a football off? That's crazy. Look, I'm sharing my feelings right now, which is something I hate doing, because I have to put this in terms that you can understand. Yesterday should have been the best day of my life. I'm in a school where I don't know anyone, and I was made quarterback of the football team. And since then, all that you've said is that I don't deserve it. Do you know how small that makes me feel? Small as a baby ladybug? I'm better at football than you. Deep down, you have to know that. And if you're as good at football as you say you are, be good at this part. Be my teammate, man. You're right. You are better at football than me. I'm really sorry. It's okay. You're better than me at feelings. <laughs> Hug? <laughs> yes, all right! Hey, handsome. Oh, hey, Lexi. So you decided to roll solo like me. Oh, no, actually, uh, I have a date. Oh, and I owe you a thank you because you're the one who gave me the idea to ask a friend. Oh, Aisha. Yeah. This is great. Right? Thanks. Have so much fun. You too. You too. Very cool dress. You click a cupcake. If you have half a brain. Oh, I love this song. It was played at my first wedding. Okay, great. Maybe I'll see you in class. Hey, um, Jamie, can we talk? Sure. Um, I'll start. Have you ever noticed how all M&Ms taste exactly the same except when they're in a Skittles bag? Okay, maybe I'll start. Um, look, we all love your pep talks. I was just wondering if they could be a little bit more inspirational. Like, you could talk more about winning and a little less about the stupid touchy-feely stuff. Okay, I see what's going on here. This is because we went to the dance together, isn't it? What? Yeah, you're nagging me because you had like a really good time at the dance even though we went as friends, and now you don't know whether to ask me out or not. <laughs> no way, what makes you think that? I kind of feel the same way. You do? I, uh, I owe you a thank you. For what? We didn't get the W. <sighs> Maybe not. But we got something more important. We got the end for knowledge. You know, you're right. It does feel good to get fired up and actually try to win. Well, that's something, I guess. Come get pizza with us. Hey, fast, think Aisha. <sighs> I did it wrong again. <laughs> Whoever you're texting must be pretty funny. Who is it? Gabriel Iglesias or your boyfriend, Jamie? Oh my God, stop. I don't like Jamie. I mean, look at this. How did he make hallway harder to spell? I know, uh, Jamie is hot, but even if he did like me, I can never date this dummy. Oh, I ate audio record. Yikes, wouldn't want to send that. Oh God, I sent that to him. Take it back, Siri, take it back, take it back! Sorry, new policy, you'll get your phone back at the end of the day. No! You can't. Calm down. Life only gets worse. Maybe Jamie's phone got taken away before he saw it. 
Yeah, that's a possibility. Oh. Aisha, let's stop playing games. Well, I mean, except for football. And also, you should know that I'm full-on addicted to Call of Duty. But uh, what I'm trying to say is, will you go to dinner with me tonight? Life's so short, let's make it lunch. Lunch? That's even more romantic. <laughs> This is so nice, Jamie. Maybe too nice. I, I mean, you don't really know me. I could be the kind of person who says mean things behind people's back for no reason. No, I couldn't imagine that. And I'm great at imagining. Here, check it out. Blue cat on a bike. He just ate a pizza. You are good at that. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I hope it's okay I ordered for us. How'd you know? Because I listened to you. And also because your Instagram handle is get you someone who looks at you like I look at pigs in a blanket. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That's how I imagine you laughing when you text LOL. Ooh. Stop eavesdropping, pervs. We're not. We're the base of the acapella group. But uh Ooh, but, baby, but, I love your way. Da, 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 every day, da, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. This is so fun. We should do it again tomorrow. Yeah, uh... Jamie, what would you want to do together if we only had today? Like, I was going to die tomorrow. <laughs> or more specifically, at 3 p.m. today when we get our phones back. Oh, that's easy. I'd like to spend your final hours having the most perfect romantic day of all time. Yeah, uh, me too. Aww. That time we were just listening. <laughs> Ooh, baby, I love your way. That looks like Every a mess. <laughs> <laughs> Wanna tell you I love your way. What are you but doing here? Do not use the emergency safety shower for sexy fun. Yeah. my phone. You can go through it if you want. The passcode is 8008. Boob. Wait, you don't care if I go through your phone? No. That's crazy that there's not weird stuff on here you don't want me to see. Oh yeah, there definitely is. But what's the point of starting a relationship if it's not from a place of complete trust, you know? Oh, come on. Every relationship starts with a couple little lies, right? You've never done that before? No, of course not. Aisha, we just spent the most perfect day together. Why would I ruin that by deceiving you? You're right. I know Jamie's hot, but even if he did like me, I can never date this dummy. Hey. Um, I'm so sorry. I only said what I said because I knew that I liked you. And I didn't know if you felt the same way. I was the one who was dumb for you saving. You know what? Um, save it. Because you're right. I am hot. And sometimes I can't be dumb. Like right now, for instance, I'm being dumb enough to think that the amazing day we just had together means more than one bad text. Jamie, presents from your ex-lovers. Oh, weird. I'll open them later. <laughs> oh, look. This one's already open. <laughs> wow, it's an Oculus from Holly. She got you an Oculus? And Sienna got you floor seats to the Lakers-Clippers game. How thoughtful. Isn't that the last game you went to before your grandpa passed? <laughs> A Laker girl hugged him, and grandpa got a streak of her boob makeup on his face. <laughs> I've always liked Sienna. For an Instagram celebrity, she was really down to earth. You know what, I'm gonna go find Daisy. I'll come with you. No, stay here and open your presents. Aisha, wait, are you mad at me? Jamie, I swear to you I'm not. Well, you're mad about something. What do you want me to do? 
throw the presents out? Cause I will. I don't need this or a Rolex or some song that Billie Eilish wrote for me personally. No, throwing them away is even worse. How? God, you're being impossible. Then don't be with me. What? Oh. oh. Thank God I found you in the first room I checked. I have to tell you something. There was a scheme to break you and Jamie up, but I heroically stopped it. I also started it. It was my scheme. What? I'm sorry. I guess I wanted you guys to break up because I like Jamie. I know. Daisy told me. That bitch is lying. Sorry, reflex. Just, look, I want Jamie to be happy and he's happy with you. I'm the one who got him all the gifts. You have no reason to be jealous. <laughs> jealous? I don't get jealous, honey. I'm dope. God, you're so confident. You would be too if you had feet as big and beautiful as I do. <laughs> okay, wait, so if you weren't jealous, then why are you so upset? Cause at school, Jamie and I, we don't seem all that different, but being in this big fancy house, watching him open all those expensive gifts, it, it made me feel weird. I mean, I don't have money to buy him an Oculus. I didn't even get him anything for his birthday. Don't laugh, but that's why I was in here. I was trying to make him a gift. Mm. Yo, holy God, what is that thing? It's supposed to be Jamie. Huh. Let me give you some advice. Jamie doesn't need things, especially not a haunted painting from hell. He just needs to know that you care about him. He really likes you. He does? Yeah. And love across class lines happens all the time. My dad was rich, but my mom was just hot. Aren't your parents divorced? Yeah, it was never gonna work. They're from two different worlds. Hey, Jamie. How you holding up? Uh, I'm hanging in there. What the hell? I'm not dead. Oh, but you're leaving. What am I supposed to do? Text you? Call you? Hang out after school and on the weekends because we're kids and we have no obligations? Yeah. And I'm still here for another six weeks. Come on, there's got to be a way you can stay at Bayside. I mean, what if you move to the Palisades? There's a house for sale in my neighborhood. Yeah, the floor plan is kind of claustrophobic, but I know a great contractor. I can't afford a house. I can't afford Spotify without commercials. Well, what if you just say you live at my house? No, that's illegal. Please just chill. I can't chill. My resting body temp is 102. I'm like a Labrador. I got to go to class. I will miss you. I got your text. What's going on? So I thought about what you said how I needed to be more chill. Mm -hmm. And I thought, what better way to be chill than to chill together for the rest of our lives? No, 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 no. Come on out, boys. No, boys, go back in. Aisha, this has been the best month and a half or whatever of my life. Will you make me the happiest dude in homeroom and marry me? No! This is insane. Get up. No, it's not that insane. I mean, I love you, and if we were married, we'd have the same address, and you could stay at Bayside. I thought that's what you wanted. I do, but... She said I do! <laughs> no, I don't. I'm tired of people making decisions for me. I didn't decide to come here, and I didn't decide to leave. And now you're just deciding that we should get married? I know this is crazy, but we have to do something. No, I have to do something. Hey, Aisha, um, can we talk about that sort of insane thing I did earlier? Uh, no need. I'm perfectly happy pretending that it never happened. Listen, you know I love pretending. I mean, Right before you got here, I was pretending this mechanical pencil is a big, scary needle. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Look, I don't want to pretend in our relationship. I want to be real. Okay. 
I've done a pretty bad job of listening to you all day, but I am finally paying attention. For example, I can tell that you don't want to be having this conversation right now. And I also noticed that you don't mind the idea of not seeing me every day. And I noticed that you cringed when I said the word love. But I can't help how I feel. I do love you. Okay, sorry, I did just cringe, yeah. but I really like you and I'm having fun. I know, but when someone doesn't feel the same way about you that you feel about them, it's not a good fun. It's a sad fun, like a cruise. Man, this is over, isn't it? Yeah, I think it might be. Be honest. Did I make a huge mistake with Jamie? Aisha, you don't need me to tell you what to do. You got this. Yeah. So I'll be mature and give him space. No, stop being an idiot and go tell him how you feel. God, this is the microwave all over again. I'm gonna go talk to him. <laughs>